If we don't know where we started, we have no conception of where we are or how we got here. She is a national treasure, a walking history book. History is what happens to us every day, that we're all making history. Betty's a rock star in the Park Service. Everybody will elbow their way through the crowd to get to say hi to Betty. Thank you, Betty, for your extraordinary service. I'm not really a historian. I'm sharing my oral history. She's sort of like Betty Davis, Angela Davis, and Yoda all wrote in one. <laughs> she is the country's oldest full-time park service ranger, and she works in Richmond at the Rosie the Riveter World War II Homefront National Historical Park. I didn't know about Rosie the Riveter's memorial because it had not freed anyone that I knew. All the memorials, all the museums in the country are really about wars and the military. How do you look at the awkward parts of the story? It's not a pretty picture. The history as I had lived it was nowhere in sight, not one minute of it. She's able to talk about these incredibly difficult topics. I was 27 years old, married, and a mother by the time my slave ancestor died. And so now she has a platform and a willing co-conspirator in the National Park Service. It's like I'm running a federally funded revolution. <laughs> <laughs> the opportunity to insert the African-American stories. That's what the park became for me. The young interpreters are looking to Betty as a leader in learning about their own story. Because what gets remembered is determined by who's in the room doing the remembering. So many people have lived my history, and so many people have lived your history. And the nation is bereft without those. It took her the better part of her life to really find her own voice. I have a deep sense of being in my last decade, that if I don't get it right, I don't have time to do it over. This is a slice of history, that to not learn it is really not to know America. My story is important because I represent an important part of the American narrative. And when I'm on this stool, my story will not be forgotten.